so we are here at the construction site of the Fort St. John Interplex Oval, which is the third long track speed skating facility in Canada. And we're here to bury a time capsule of Olympic silver medalist Denny Morrison and Jay Morrison, Canadian multiple medalist. And the guys really want to leave their mark this new facility. Wherever you guys, the camera guys. Yeah, I think we just want to go about 20 paces where there's a middle one. Seeking out a good spot right now. The guys are digging right now. This is going to be under one of the hockey arenas as the oval is on the second level. Got Mayor Bruce Lance here for the ceremony and Yeah, don't break a foot. Grab this out if you want. Here we got this is the uh tube we skated in. It was knit by one of the members of the club, one of the older members, uh Rita Johnson and Dina Allen. We made these tubes for everyone in the club. And they kept us warm on the cold skating days. And the during the outdoor oval days, same, same as these hot pads. Keep our feet and hands warm. We're skating outdoors. This is important kid, right? The, the Five, really, years old? Yeah. yeah. And it's very characteristic thing about these is the near flaps. I think Don Gladys helped with this too. Uh, okay. But yeah, everyone in the club had one of those. And for some reason, this doesn't have the palm palms. And palm palms on the top. Oh, no. Then what do we got? Uh, the next thing we have. Medals from when we were kids. Also training out of the Fort St. John Oval. And then we got there's a T-shirt from the Olympic Oval in Calgary, which is the first Olympic Oval built in Canada. So uh, so to, to remember, this is the second one, and living in the legacy of the Calgary Oval. This is something me and Denny brought back from Japan, and uh, we were in Japan at the World Junior Championships. This is the first time that we skated internationally together as juniors. Denny was 17 and I was 19. So it represents sort of the potential this facility has for future generations. And we each have sort of a thing. So I just signed this card on my con cards. It says, here's to more Forte John Olympians to come. Or better just a little. Let's hear that again. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, here's to more Forte John Olympians to come. Oh, these ones. Yeah. Oh, let's see that. This is the Morrison Brothers Homecoming in the spring of 2009. And that's the first time we got to really walk through the oval and see it. And to top it all off, what sums it up best is this plaque that was given to, well, Jay, this is Jay's plaque, but we each got one in 2001 uh, for being. City 14 John Lashaven, so Jay Morrison, our champion in long track speed skating in 14 John, the energetic city. Uh, it goes along quite nicely with the uh, Vinny Matter Plus here, so I should uh, go on top of it. Alright, before you toss it in, let's just set up the camera. Do you want to put it in the bag? Or? We kind of need, like. That it's perfect. Perfect fit. Okay. 
Hold that, hold that. Is this to buy to some of those cherished items? Or? Well, it just sort of represents some of the steps we took um, growing up, training outdoors and the outdoor track used to be right at this site and uh, some of our first international competitions. And uh, one of the items is something that represents one of the other ovals in Canada, the first oval in Canada. So for this to be uh, the second permanent oval in Canada, it's pretty special to be right here. It's more, uh, it's more exciting to kind of bury this in the ground and kind of look forward to the future as to what this building will hold. Yeah. <laughs>